Hello and welcome to the Blender Hobbit. In this video, I'm going to show you something different uh, to make uh, a model in Google Earth Pro. Uh, I want to show you what I mean. For example, if I click Manhattan, <coughs> you can see there are many 3D objects here. They are actually embedded by Google, but if you wanted to add some statue or buildings like a Liberty statue, for example, it's going to come, you can add your building, your uh, uh, industrial uh, structure or for example you can add a lighthouse something like this you can add mm, a building something like this or a skyscraper or even I call it spaceship but actually it is not a spaceship you can add something like that. You don't have to add, for example, you can add your skyscraper model. For example, in London, you can see, I uh, actually, here is better, I think. You can add your even you don't have to add on the earth you can add something uh, more realistic not like mine more realistic spaceship on Google Earth and you can show something like that you you have seen some futuristic aliens uh, movies there are uh, spaceship on uh, buildings you can add something like that and I'm going to add this one to this spaceship. Um, first of all, I want to show you how to uh, modify your object to do it. First of all, you have to export your uh, object as Collada. Uh, for example, I'm going to uh, save it as spaceship EAE. It must be dot EAE. And now go to. I'm going to delete this and I'm going to click here, right click here because you you have to uh, take its face, it's going to show you your elevation here. Now go to add, add your model. And I'm going to space click it ship name it as spaceship and I'm going to add this one to my model. I think it's this one. Yeah. And now you can see I can move it. This one, right or back, and I can change your altitude. For example, you can see that I think it must be a little bit higher. That's good, and you can add it. I think. It can be on the this building, for example. It can look like more futuristic aliens invade this building, which is oh maybe a king or queen will angry, so I will just park on this building. I don't want to make them angry 
120 meter maybe oh no oh no uh, leave it again okay click here add space ship folder paste it and yes altitude relative to ground um, as a little bit higher maybe 200 meters and I think I'm going to add this one on this building or on the water you you, you know uh, wherever you want you can add it and finally I'm going to click OK. Yes, now you have a spaceship uh, in your Google Earth Pro. You can add your building, skyscraper, you can add a spaceship, actually, more realistic advice and advice, and or you can add a uh, lighthouse or a futuristic, futuristic building that depends on you whatever you want you have to export it as <laughs> .dae this is uh, which format uh, Google uh, Earth Pro wants it and another limitation is it have to be it has to be maximum it has to have had uh, has or whatever it's it must be less than 64,000 words yeah you can't add a very high quality thing and you can't add a very little tiny things this is about 200 meters and I think this skyscraper is almost uh, uh, in almost realistic uh, in almost realistic um, size. So uh, your size must be big, and your vertices must be less than sixty-four thousand vertices. That's all. Thanks for watching. I like this uh, topic actually, so I wanted to share it with you. Uh, if you like this too, you should or you can uh, subscribe my channel and thumbs up like my video. Thanks for watching again.